loves your girl is back with another interesting video so in today's video we're going to be talking about green beans what are green beans what are the causes of green beans how can you get rid of your green beans treatments for green beans and i'll also be talking about some products and ingredients you can use to get rid of your green beans so if this sounds interesting to you please make sure you like this video give this video a huge thumbs up because i'm very sure you're going to end up enjoying this video and keep on watching <music> channel this is your first time of seeing my beautiful face hi my name is joy and i create content on skincare natural and beauty tips and the likes so make sure you join the family by subscribing to the channel for more skincare natural and beauty and wellness video also make sure you turn on your notification bell so that you'll be notified when new videos like this come up on my channel now let's get straight into the video so you guys already know what green beans are like i don't think i need to describe or explain what green beans are we all have beans on our body right we have beans all over our body but there are some veins that are very very visible and very disgusting like i think visible veins should be illegal like why would you have a flawless skin fine skin clean skin and then your veins will be showing like it's very irritating like girl you need to get rid of your green veins and that is what i'm going to be helping you to do in this video so i'll leave pictures of how green veins look like green veins very coarse veins i'll leave pictures on the screen for you guys to see what they look like so they can appear in different parts of your body like they can become very obvious in different parts of your body so it could be on this inner arm here there could be green veins here it could also be on your hands below your wrist it could also be on your feet or it could even be on your chest yeah there are different places that your green veins can be very very obvious visible for people to see and then you notice that people will start talking what's wrong with you why are you bleaching your skin because yes most people will blame green veins on bleaching that yes you are bleaching your skin that is why your green veins are very visible but now let's talk about some of the causes of green veins one major cause of green vein is thinning of the skin like when your skin thin out over time your green veins will start coming out they'll start popping out and visible for people to see now what's a skin thinning skin thinning is the effect of you bleaching your skin or using a fast action whitening product that white your skin rapidly so once you use a very harsh product a bleaching product that whitens up your skin in 7 14 days yes you definitely thin out your skin because all these ash creams contains hydroquinone and steroid that would help thin out your skin so once your skin is thinning out you will notice that your green veins will start showing it will be very very visible for people to see so bleaching cream will definitely thin out your skin let's just call it what it is bleaching cream will thin out your skin and once it thins out your skin your green veins will definitely be visible for people to see it's going to be very very obvious everybody have veins don't get me wrong everybody have veins even dark skinned people have veins light skinned people have veins everybody have veins but dark skinned people's veins are not obvious do you know why this is because their skin produces more melanin than light skinned people so the overproduction of melanin on their skin does not make their green veins to be visible but because light skinned people tend to produce lesser melanin there's every possibility of your green veins showing there's every probability of it popping out so that is why you want to make sure you are not still using a very ash product that would make it more obvious all right you want to make sure your fair skin is flawless without green veins popping out of your skin like girl you, you need to get rid of it bleaching cream would also reduce collagen production on your skin or even prevent collagen production at all on your skin so when your skin is not producing collagen like it's supposed to do your skin will thin out which will then make your green veins also very visible and that's why i tell people to make sure they're taking anti-aging supplements into their body like you can take collagen supplements so there are different kind of collagen supplements you can use to up speed up collagen production on your skin and prevent your skin from thinning out all right I have a video here on my channel i'll leave the link up here and also in the description box in that video i talked about different collagen supplements different anti-aging supplements that you can use that would prevent your skin from thinning out that would also boost collagen production on your skin and just give you this youthful look make you look younger and you need to start taking this supplement right from your 20s you don't need to wait till when you're already aging before you start taking them no that is not how it works you need to start taking them early so that you won't age quickly all right so that is just 
just by the way now let's help you get rid of your green beans how do you get rid of your green beans the number one thing you want to do this is very very important guys you want to discontinue the body lotion that is giving you green beans like you need to discontinue it like what's the essence of you having a fair skin of you having a clean and flawless skin when your green beans are obvious when they are visible for people to see like it's not going to even make your skin look nice at all like people will always think you're bleaching your skin all right so you want to make sure you discontinue any bleaching cream all these fast action creams seven days whitening creams you're using you need to discontinue stop them like those are the things that are causing your green veins especially if you don't have green veins before and you notice that you started having green veins when you start using a body lotion then that body lotion is causing your green veins you need to discontinue it because you might not know like it might not be your fault you might not know that the cream you are using is a bleaching cream all right now after you've stopped this cream you get a very good moisturizing body lotion to use on your skin just to try to tone down your complexion and repair your skin all right you can get a very good repair and moisturizing body lotion that you can use the amlatin body lotion is a very good repair body lotion that would also help moisturize your skin so as it is moisturizing your skin it is helping you repair your skin because when your green veins are visible for people to see that is a sign of damaged skin so this body lotion would help repair your skin and it doesn't even have to be that expensive you can even use shea butter to repair your skin yes shea butter is very very good for repairing the skin so you can just stop that cream and start applying shea butter all over your body like you will notice that it will tone down your skin tone like it's going to tone down your complexion you'll not be as white as before you'll not be as fair as before but what is important is you trying to get rid of your green veins to make your skin look naturally fair to give you this natural fairness and not a white skin that all your green veins will be popping out so this shea butter would help blend your skin even out your skin tone and also reduce the visibility of your green veins all right so you just notice that your green veins is not as obvious as before they are not as visible as before after some weeks of you using shea butter also i'll be recommending some repair products that you can use that they work specially for green veins like this product will help get rid of your green veins they are specifically formulated to eliminate green veins they are going to make it less visible for people to see and the number one product i'll be recommending is the shenik perfect leg serum should i say serum or oil yeah it's not really an oil because it's kind of watery in consistency yeah it's watery so it's like a serum so this shenik perfect leg as stage one and stage two depending on how visible your green veins are or how serious your green veins are all right so this shiny perfect leg is very very good for green veins it's going to help get rid of green veins varicose veins body spots like it's a very very good anti-reaction serum that you can use to get rid of your green veins also if you have varicose veins if you have spider veins this shiny perfect leg would help get rid of them like this serum works this is something i've tried before that worked for me and that's why i'm reviewing it for you guys it's going to help get rid of your green veins no cap now the second product you want to use to help get rid of your green veins is crude kenako this crude kenako is small but mighty like it is very very effective guys when i mean effective like very very effective this is something i've tried out it's a very very good product for green veins like it's going to help fade out your green veins they're not going to be visible again like people will not even see through your skin to see your green veins any longer and this could can can also be used to prevent you from getting green veins yes it is not only going to cure green veins but it's also going to prevent your skin from getting green veins even if you don't have green veins already for example if you want to try out a body lotion and you don't know if that body lotion will react badly on your skin you don't know if that body lotion will make your green veins become very visible you can just mix a bit of this crude kenako into that body lotion like there's no green vein that will show on your skin this is a tested and trusted recipe guys crude kenako would help prevent your green veins from popping out now this crude kenako is not always very available in every skincare store all right you might need to have to go to an organic store for you to get this crude kenako but it is very very effective now if you cannot get this crude kenako i have another product for you guys so this product is called the kenako oil so it's like crude kenako but this is just like the oil version of the crude kenako because the crude kenako is not an oil like it is very very thick like a cream all right but this kenako oil is like a oil i'll leave picture on the screen for you guys to see this also is a very good anti-reaction oil that you can use to get rid of your green veins because green veins is also a form of reaction all right you are reacting to a bleaching cream so this kenako oil 
would make your green veins to be less visible. Like people are not going to see it. It's not going to be obvious. It's going to help blend your skin in such a way that they will not be able to see through your skin to see your green veins, all right? It can also serve as a preventive oil. If you want to prevent your skin from getting green veins, you can also add this oil into your body lotion. I'm not sure if the body lotion would cause you green veins. Just apply this kind of oil into your body lotion. Like guys, you will come back to give me good reviews. Like this is something I have tried. Like all these three products are something that I've tried and they work like they are going to work all right but please you want to make sure you are not applying this product directly on your skin because they are very very strong products that you don't want to just apply directly on your skin make sure you are mixing them with either your body lotion or your body oil guys make sure to mix them don't use it directly on your skin all right and i promise you like i promise you it's going to get rid of your green veins your green veins are not going to be visible like you just notice that you no longer have green veins like you can no longer see your green veins yes that is how effective these products are. So just try out any of these products and I'll be waiting for you in my comment section to hear your feedbacks. All right. So if this video was helpful, please make sure you give this video a huge thumbs up to show that, yeah, you enjoy what you watch and it was helpful to you. Also, if you have not subscribed to my channel, please, guys, please, please, please subscribe to my channel. Help me get to 1K. That would really encourage me to keep showing up here on YouTube. All right. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you in my next one. Bye.